Vision is the most frustrating of senses. We hear what there is to hear, taste what there is to taste, smell what there is to smell, and feel what there is to feel. If there is more behind what we sense, we don't seem to care very much. But vision is different. When we look at something, we know for a fact that there is more behind what we see. We see the surface of things, not the essence. That makes us anxious. What if there is something really important back there? like God or the truth. It's not surprising then that people have been trying to see beyond appearances for centuries. Plato tried, Galileo tried, and so did Wilhelm Röntgen, as we can see in this famous picture. It was taken by Röntgen himself, probably in early 1896. The German physicist had just discovered, or should we say engineered the production of, X-rays. His first images were understandably blurry, but he'd made corrections. Here he's showing off his newly perfected technique in an x-ray of his colleague Albert von Kölliker's left hand. The effect is still stunning, and it must have been more so for people who had never seen or even conceived of an x-ray. For here we see what we have always wanted to see, the insides of a living human body. The view is satisfying, but truth be told, it is also a little frightening. When Röntgen took an x-ray of his wife's hand and showed it to her, she was reported to have said, I have seen my death. In a sense she was right, or would have been in another age. For before the era of x-rays, ultrasounds, CAT scans, and MRIs, an open viewable body was something to be feared, for it signaled impending death. If you could see inside, you were about to go away. Moreover, the skeleton itself was an archetype of mortality, so to see your own skeleton was to see your own death. Röntgen probably knew people would be frightened by his ghostly images. So he took care to include something that served both a scientific and humanistic purpose. Wedding bands. They demonstrated the sensitivity of x-rays to materials of different densities, but they also personalized his images. Without the rings, the pictures say, this is a dead hand. With the rings, the pictures say, this is your hand, and you are alive.